Okay, so I'm one with I'm with one of the legends of jump racing. Simon Sherwood. No, I was only eight when Des Torquid won with you on the Gold Cup. Could you tell it? Take us through that moment when you when you actually won. It was it looked like he was beaten, wasn't it? For yeah, it was. With Yahoo. Yeah, absolutely. I think it was sort of um, there were so many sort of mixed emotions from about two or three hours. Obviously, poor old um, footballman's horse got killed coming down the hill, and then Yahoo suddenly appeared, and then I thought, well. That's it, we're done now. I know, because I've, I've watched this race right. back and it's, it's really? such a, there was a lot amazing of, race. Yeah, there was lots of highs and lows. In one moment, yes, you're winning, then you weren't going to win. And then I say, when Tom Morgan appeared on Yahoo, then I thought, well, that, that was it, as far as I concerned. And then as we went to, I think we jumped second last, and then he changed legs, I remember, between second last and last, and then got on, a, I think, possibly a little bit of better ground, I'm not yeah. sure. And suddenly there was a ray of hope all of a sudden, went and to the last, crowd and, and then exactly, the crowd started cheering, went to last, and there was no stride there at all, and we were all getting pretty tired, so it was a case of literally just popping in and getting over. Luckily, Tom was doing the same on Yahoo. Yeah. And then I remember just thinking, I'm absolutely knackered, I'm not sure if I got my set. And then just thinking, hold on, there's only one gold cup and yeah. here we are. But and that extra bit of... Yeah, energy. well, I think the old horse, because funny, in the his, historically, the old horse had always on the run in at Cheltenham, had always gone off to right. Yeah. Hence, that's why he was always better right-handed. Right -handed, and then yeah. for some reason or other, he went left this particular time. And now he's quite violently left, almost as if to sort of have a go at Yahoo yeah. up running. And then I remember just seeing a Yahoo on my left side, I mean, to correct him. Pull him straight just to make sure we didn't bump into him, uh, and then obviously went about length clear. But the one thing I'll always remember more than anything is, is probably Tom Morgan's reaction afterwards. Yeah. Uh, and I think I'd been gutted if I'd been him in the same position. Absolutely, yeah. been gutted. And then he just coming across and tapping on his head and saying, "You yeah, know, that is a champion." Yeah. Yeah. So how old was this talking when he won that race? I think he was either nine or ten. One of them, so. What are you doing at the moment? Me, I'm still I'm here at the races. races. I'm still sort of do a bit of buying and selling, mostly with Aidan Murphy or yeah. Wicks and Bloodstock. Uh, do a little bit of involvement in that. Otherwise, no, I, uh, we've got some pointers at home for my son Jack, uh, but otherwise, uh, I'm doing steel, biz, uh, steel buildings and things like that. So, totally diverse from, from the yeah, racing the side of it. Race. But, but uh, is your son uh, interested in Yeah, no, he's with um, Venetia Williams uh, there as, as her amateur. Uh, and he was just actually getting a quite a good sort of run at the moment, and he unfortunately he's just gone and broken his collarbone, so he's out Which for happened. two so, yeah, yeah. part well, and parcel. Wish him a good recovery. I will. I will. And your brother, I think, is it Oliver? Also Oliver, yeah, he trains in Lamborn, Um and he's having quite a good year this year. So I, you know, I keep very much in touch with all the boys, and so it's always nice to pop in from time to time. Exactly. Well, thanks for chatting to us today. Not um, at all. Nice to see you again. Okay. Thanks.